I classify Pop Pop as a cannibal. Hello, and welcome to the third episode of Enter the Couriorverse. Third episode of Evil Pig After Hours, even. Today, we're going to be going into the hotel here in Prim and hopefully not die as Pop Pop. Um, uh, last episode, we had to heal him up from all of his wounds, his broken legs, headache, crippling torso. Everything. He's... He's way too fragile. I don't know if he's actually gonna be able to make it through this. Honestly, I feel like I don't even want to go in here, but... They have dynamite in there. I know it. Pop Pop knows it. Uh, let's just... Let's just see if we can actually do this. Oh! Already! Oh! I wasn't expecting them to be right here in the entrance all of a sudden, but that was actually relatively easy. They went down without really any problem. Okay. Oh, I can't... I can't do any of this. Pop-Pop's not smart enough, and he also doesn't know how locks work. He'd probably blow up the door, but that's not how this game works, sadly. Let's go and look through these guys. Oh! Definitely need the dog meat. That's something that's really important. Okay, then. So that's all he had. Dynamite. Yes. Definitely need more dynamite. Empty garbage can. Sort of like... My heart. Ooh. Yes! I will take that. Tells of a junk town vendor. Pre-war money. Oh, another hard... Hard lock pick. Pack of cigarettes, I can sell that. Oh! There we go. Stop shooting me directly. There. More dog meat, mintats. Ooh, Sunset Sarsaparilla. Uh, I need to heal myself a little bit. Might as well actually also use all the stuff that I picked up, like that one book, Spec Ops book, and there was the other one, Tales of a Junk Town Vendor. I don't know if that can actually just increase. It does. Barter. Everyone knows I needed that a while back, but oh well. Let's just go ahead and drink some of this Sunset Spasper. Yeah, that'll work. Maintenance store. Mm, I can't unlock this. There we go. I'll take that one. Why not? Oh! Why, yes I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. Uh, definitely Indeed, more interested in that. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. Oh, uh. that's just marvelous. I think I'll be making my way outside now. The air is a little close in here. Oh, hold on, whippersnapper. You stay right here. Oh, so gracious of you to offer to bodyguard me like that. But I'd only slow you down. See you outside. Uh, the only reason why I'm not killing you right now is because you have information that I need. Alright. Let's do this. It's time for a war. Oh no. Just stop it, Pop Pop. You're going too far. Oh, I'm actually kind of okay. Oh. Excellent view. <laughs> Alright. Pop-pop actually made it. 
surprisingly. Incinerator is still considered a gun. Well, on to the upper level then. Ooh. <sighs> oh, you know what? I should probably change from dynamite to my pickaxe again. Oh, no. Why is he running away? Okay, whatever. Ooh. Another plunger. Aha. Uh -huh. You like that? Did he have some dynamite out that he was? He was about to throw dynamite at me. Oh, more people. Oh, jeez. You like that? No. Ah. Whew. I was getting dangerously close. I'll take that. And more dynamite, of course. Oh! I'm over encumbered. Ah, uh, we all knew this moment was going to be coming soon. I guess I don't need the baseball cap. Uh, I don't need any of that, Pop Pop. Goodbye. Close. Oh, I need to heal myself. Oh, I'm so glad I remembered that. Let's go ahead and, um, get some Nuka Cola up in here. Why are there so many Nuka Cola bottles around a Sunset Sarsaparilla vending machine? That doesn't make any sense. Oh. Hello, Skelly Man. I'll take your whiskey. Woo, don't! Kinda of surprised to see me. I'll take it to Psycho as well. You. you. Just chill out in there, I guess. Again, Sunset Sarsaparilla can or bottles right next to a Nuka Cola vending machine. None of this makes sense. Pop Pop has survived the majority of this. I feel like there's still stuff missing, though. I just have it. This deep ingrained feeling that there's something that I'm not seeing. There was that one roller coaster outside. I can go and give that a look see. Alright. Now, let's go and find a good way to get onto this roller coaster. Yeah, there is an entrance up there. Oh no. I've been spotted. Oh, been shot at. Who's shooting at me? Where? Oh, there you are. No, don't fall down! Dang it. Oh man, steam gauge assemblies take up a lot of space in your inventory. That makes sense, honestly, though. Okay, then let's go ahead and drop some junk. Not the Nuka-Cola trucks. Have to keep that. Paperweight. I don't need that. I didn't even mean to pick that up. Don't need that. Take a 30 weight! Oh my gosh. Steam gauge assemblies are taking up 90... 90 weight in, in total. Vacuum cleaner. I don't need that. That's fine. I'll also uh, get rid of one steam gauge assembly. Fine. Ooh, a ransom note. Don't mind if I do. Anything in here? Suitcase. Some jet. Hey, level up time. Know what that means? More explosives. And one point into melee weapons. <laughs> Perfect. Ooh, I also get a um, little perk. Oh, you know. I classify Pop Pop as a cannibal. Let's go with it. <laughs> Pop Pop grows more disturbing with each passing day. <laughs> He 
did not want me to take his drugs. I can eat people now. Oh, the possibilities. Oh, this hotel goes up even further? Wait a second. I've been here before. I am done. Howdy. Hello. Well, Talk to me. That was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't we? Breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Not to diminish your role in it, of course, but it was quite thrilling. Problem is, there's still no law in Prim. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? I don't care about that. Just talk to me about the man in the checkered ah, suit. Ah, yes. My memory is much clearer now that I'm free from my bondage. I was uh, performing recon, gathering information on some of the powder gangers, when some great cons arrived with your friend in the suit. They were talking about some delivery they took from a courier. I assume that was you? They said they'd be heading through Nipton to Novak to meet a contact there. All right. We know our next location now. Before I go, let's go ahead and sell you all my sure, junk. Have a look. Don't need those. Don't need any of that. None of those. All right, now I can actually buy things from you. Like this dynamite. All right, I think I'm done with you, Johnson. Thank you. Ooh, this is the most that Pop-Up has ever had. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. Bye. All right. I believe that is the end of the third episode. We have cleared out the hotel, the, I guess, really lucky casino hotel, B Bison Steve, whatever you want to call it. We cleared it out. We're done with Prim. We're headed to Novak now on our next step to killing Benny. I believe that's his name. Yes, Benny. And also, uh, hopefully finishing up the game with Pop Pop. I don't know if he's going to survive. I was surprised he survived the Lucky Casino, but I think he can do it. He has quite a bit of dynamite now, and this trusty pickaxe seems to be doing quite a number on all of his enemies. So I think we're good to go. So until next time, see you, everybody.